What's going on YouTube? It's your buddy Will from What's Up in the Sky 37 or online at www.whatsupinthesky.com. And we got a quick one here today. I uh, just take a little break from the Rock Nest video. I've got one, two out so far. And uh, I got another a couple emails from a lady named Carol from the UK. And this was one she had sent, she had found. I haven't seen yet. And this one's is the cool one. This is another one of those smoking gun pictures. They look awesome to me. All sorts of artifacts. Starting with this weird box looking thing. Um, a lot of these anchor curves. Uh, let me show you the whole picture real quick. Um, all sorts of stuff that looks like it's been carved out with perfect shapes. Um, come up here, stuff that looks like faces and stuff that looks like it's been actually etched out and framed. So a lot of neat stuff in here. So we're going to go ahead and I'm going to show you. I'm going to pull up in Photoshop. Um, Let's see what else there was. There's also just to give you a little sneak preek for those who just want to get up and go. All these look just looks like a statue. Look at the perfect round cuts in the statue here. It looks like this was just destroyed. Um, perfect symmetry in these. Just too cool. Something here that looks like it's almost alive. We're gonna pull this up in uh, Photoshop and drop some of the colors and stuff like that here in a second. Let me just show you where to go ahead and get it. As always, I uh, am not lying. This is a real NASA photo coming right from the website. I always leave the, the link below. I can't stand videos that don't have the link. I want to go check this stuff out by myself. I don't think you guys, I, I don't want to insult your intelligence. So I want you to go check it out for yourself so you can see it and download it. That's the whole purpose why I'm doing it. So by the time my video series are done, all of us have like 700,000 pictures, 700,000 pictures on their computers, man. Just so when you want to tell somebody the truth about Mars, you could just show them. So anyway, let's go and pull this up real fast. I'm going to be quick with this because i got a lot of talking to do in the Rockness video. I'm going to try and work on one tonight if I can get it rocking and rolling. Um, but the box was one of the one things that interests me. There's, got, there's a lot of things that interest me just because of the how work every the stones look and also how some things over here look to this just uh let's see some circle discs and stuff like that um some puddles of something back here it looks like see a whole different color um also another substance a color up there but let's knock in on one let me do one let me show you here this is kind of cool too i i know this will work because it works with all the mars rover pictures if you bring it up in photoshop and hit image auto color it's going to drop the color that i think they put in and that looks a lot more like earth i mean right there uh definitely does i can see it much better so i think we're going to leave it just like this and uh we'll start with a couple things here i think that's a face too on the edge of this but Let's start with these anomalies down here. And you know what? We can just go ahead and do this whole image with the adjustments since uh, I don't have to break out a little bit. That helps a little bit there. Let's see. That looks pretty good. I like that. Let's take a look at the box first. Just an interesting shape. Like I said, I, <laughs> it looks almost like a cardboard box that just got frozen in time. Like CO2 rushed in and frozen in time. And down here looks to be some sort of instrument or some, or some sort of uh, a decoration to like a pole or something. You can see how it's got the perfectly squared off end and it's a perfect curve as it comes down. And it's almost got like a, a rounded and up handle. Um, it sits next to these pieces right here that do seem kind of be... I do think this is all off of the same structure, whatever this was, whether it was a statue or just, you know, could be somebody's walkway in their front yard, <laughs> for all we know. But let's take a look at some of these some of these blocks and see how symmetric they are right here. Look look how it worked and cut these all look. This one right here was too perfect. This right here looks to be the top of it. Looks like it's got two eyes, a whole different color, like this has been painted. Uh, also right here seems to have that same color to it, that that shiny paint. It almost looks like a quartz that's been inlaid, um, and it's got it's been carved. See how it's got that line that comes down? It's carved into it. It says next to this very carved looking rock. Uh, but if you really look at this, this looks like to be someone's nose was here, kind of like a the shape of a mouth, but maybe a very small slit, and then two bug eyes. <laughs> and uh, this round thing here definitely looks like part of a base of a sculpture, something along those lines. Pretty cool. Let me see how this looks without the, uh, if I just leave that. Yeah, I definitely like it with it. It definitely sharpens it up much more, so we're going to go with that. 
So let's see here. And also I want you to take a look at some of these, uh, just to some of the patterns here of the rock. Like this stuff, this looks to me like somebody walking up somebody's front steps here. You've got strange looking artifacts that have straight lines, more tool looking, that looks like a ratchet set or a ratchet wrench. And then like I said, you have these perfectly cut tiles almost like, and they're even rounded off. So this looks like it's an archway entrance. Even over here you see more of it, it kind of looks like. Um, and then you've got this strange, or you've got this. As you file this up, check this strange thing out. What in the? This is more of the statue. See these blocks are just perfectly blocked off. But what is this thing coming out here? This almost looks like that other thing I've seen from Rock Nest. If you go to my Rock Nest video and I say the pig on Rock Nest, that looks like it. This looks like an animal. It's, it's on Mars. It's got that long, weird snout that comes down. I don't know. To me, that's just too. It's too cool and too coincidental. You're gonna see another one on this next Rock Nest video I do um, coming up. There's uh, two on that whole picture. So, more of the uh, just looking at the blocks here. This looks to be. Now, tell me, does that look like a like a rock, or does that look like maybe some aluminum or some metal that's been tore open? See how it looks like it's been tore open there. It's pretty cool. Up here, this is just an interesting little rock sitting on top, but ah, this little box thing is weird. And look how even here, like these rocks just seem to be curved, like it was part of some building or something at one time. Um, it's something that happened here on Mars. More little perfect spears, uh, circles there. And then this right here, I couldn't make some heads or tails of. Check out the almost wet appearance this has it has all these different colors in it and will look to be almost like it's something that's hidden here like either life or this is biological like uh, vegetation maybe something like that it's got a whole area of different you know colors maybe water or something along those lines over here just a symmetry in this more the perfect circles I don't know. This one I'm having a tough time with, but it doesn't look natural to me. I mean, look at the spin and the curves in this. Um, and this right here, this this line of whatever this is here, it's got the, the circles and the perfect line across it. See how it's got a line there? And look at this here, how this does too. This got the one here, the one there. And as it comes down here, these look to be uh, inlaid or something along those lines as well. Pretty interesting area on Mars, I must say. Uh, uh, another little triangle rock there more little circles this looks like what if you take pictures on earth I've been trying to make pictures of Mars lately <laughs> to make the stuff on earth look like Mars and get a good eye for this stuff even more than what I've had just looking at these pictures for the last 15 20 years and uh, this stuff looks more like uh, twigs and stuff here on earth when you put that color in um, more of those those rounded square blocks some interesting looking shape there for a rock. More of those overhangs for these rocks are just pretty cool. You see them a lot. Um, now there was also something I wanted to just rock here. Yeah, now this rock here is another one I want to take a good look at. It's propped up and what it looks to be propped on is another whole nother stone here that looks like it's been written on. It's got a... Uh, we're gonna do this here. We're gonna change up some of the uh, the tone and stuff. Let's step back. Well, I think I step backers that way. See that that's the original. So that was when we. You know, let me bring it all the way back to the original. And let's do this. See how that looks to be carved out and knocked out there? Almost like this was part of uh, some sort of statue at one time too, or like this this part wouldn't have been up something it looks like it was etched out of there um, let me see if we can't pull it forward first we'll do the all the color on it and then adjustments uh, brightness contract contrast see how it's got the that the colors when you drop it that's pretty cool tell me that doesn't look like just a piece of metal that's been uh, that's just been brought down and it almost looks like a lion's face if you really look at it see this would be the eye this would be the mouth or something and like I said check that out how that drops and it's got that cool sparkly stuff on it um, okay so let's cancel out of that step backwards something to look at when you download this this too here how this is just coming up like a like a 
a root would. I mean, it looks like a root, if you ask me. And this thing also, too, is an interesting little little rock there. I'm not sure exactly what it is. Um, again, once again, I showed you this earlier. How this? See how the stuff it just looks twisted up like it's perfectly cut for something. And this right here looks to be part of a. Uh, see how this is perfect here this perfect square then it comes up the exact same way here like it was on something it looked really good kinda like a railing wood or something like that that's got really fancy uh... stonework or you know cuts to it i'm sure you're seeing stuff too like these little circle rocks and stuff like that that look like they're out of place um, what else do you guys see there's another let me see if i can see this here to me i'll leave you with this I see a face right here. I see two eyes, a nose, and a mouth, and some hair up here. It's, and it looks like it's a wavy hair. See how the hair waves off? Let me see if I can't do something with that, make that come out a little bit better. Adjustments, exposure, let me drop it. See it? I don't know. What do you guys think? Much love. Take it easy. Thank you, Carol from the UK. Had a great weekend with Anna this weekend. Hope you subscribe. I'm going to get the rock nest done this week, and then we are off. We're going to do some more moon videos. i got to go through all your guys' emails. You guys rock. Thank you for sending me emails. You're making my job easy. 11 minutes. I didn't think I'd go 11 minutes on this one, but I did. Much love.